so excited about these videos um but i'm shaking because i had too much coffee and i did my makeup today you know oh, i look good but anyways we are back again with another <laughs> all right y'all so we're back with another prank um i had too much coffee so like my hands are completely jittery right now which I had like four Splendas in it, so I don't understand how I had too much coffee. I just dumped it down the drain and quit drinking it. All right, y'all. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm calling the graveyard right now. It's gonna be funny, just listen. Yes, ma'am. I got a quick question. Okay. Okay, my husband was buried a few days ago. Uh-huh. And I'm just trying to figure out, can y'all dig up his body? Because um, the people that we got the suit from, they said that they need it returned within three to six months. And I would have to ship it off again. So I'm just trying to figure out, can y'all do that? <laughs> We don't ever do that. We haven't done that 30 years that I've been here. So. Okay, so um, what if I go out there and dig up his body myself and take his suit from arrested. him? Money order, money. Um, yes, sir. I got a quick question. Okay, I ended up buying a car from y'all a few days ago, and I think it was possessed because somebody left a Ouija board in the car. What car, me? Um, yeah, it was a car that y'all sold to me. Yeah, what car? Um, it was a Kia Soul 2016. I don't sell any Kia Soul. Probably you called the wrong location. No, I think I bought it from y'all. I think, um, yeah, I think I yeah. bought it from y'all. I'm pretty sure I did. No, you, I don't sell any Kia Soul. You called the wrong location. Okay, is there a manager that I could speak to? I'm the manager. I don't sell any Kia Soul this year. I don't have any Kia Soul. Okay. Is there anybody higher than you, like HR, that I could speak to or something? No, it's not half a one, but call the dealer where you bought the car, miss. You call the wrong location. No, I'm sure I bought it from y'all. It's okay. It's just, no, I love the car. I love the car, but um, there was a Ouija board that was in the car, and it's kind of possessed right now. What are you calling? Are you calling to Paniagua in East Ridge, Tennessee? Yes. You don't know? Yeah, you don't know where you're calling? No, I am. I'm calling because there was a Ouija board in the car and it was sold to me. I don't sell any Kia sold this year. you confused. No, I'm not confused. It's okay. Can I speak to like HR or somebody else? And I'm the only person here. What Kia Soul? What color? It was a silver Kia Soul. I don't sell any Kia Soul. You call the wrong location. But I remember buying it from y'all. That's what I'm saying. Maybe you wasn't in that day. Oh no, I'm the only person who works here. How long did you buy it? I just bought it a week ago. I don't feel any Kia Soul here last week. I don't have any Kia Soul in inventory either. I hear somebody else speaking. Can I speak to him? Yeah, if you want to speak to the customer. No, it's not a customer. 
Please, nobody here. I don't sell any key at all. You call the wrong location. Make sure what location you call it, please. Okay. Please, no. Have a good day. All right, thank you. You too. Oh, thank you for calling Drive Time. All calls may be recorded for quality and training purposes. Hey, you're calling Josh, I'm Chadwick, this is Daniel. Yes, ma'am, are you the manager? I'm not, I'm one of the cell agents. Is there something I can help you with? Um, yes, ma'am, I think we have an issue, and I didn't know if y'all had any holy water for this, but y'all ended up, y'all ended up selling me a car. Oh, sorry, the phone is cutting out. Can you hear me? Um, I can hear you just fine. Um, I said that y'all ended up selling me a car. And it had a Ouija board in it. So it's, there's a lot of demonic stuff going on with this car now. Okay, I'm not really sure what you are wanting me to do. Are you able to put somebody else on the phone like a manager or something? Because I want to see what they can do about this. How long ago did you purchase the vehicle? Um, last week. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Okay. What phone number did you use? Two four nine eight three one thirty two sixty four. He's not pulling anything up. Can I get a first and last name? Uh, Jessica J E S S I C A. B U R K I N S O N. All right, well, Jessica, I'm not pulling up a recent purchase under that name or phone number. Okay, um, do you think it should be under my husband's name then? It was both of us, actually. Okay, do you know who was first on the loan? Um, him. Okay, let me try to get him. Hold on, give me just a moment here. He kept his mom's what last name. Number? Um, his phone number is 285-389-2242. Um, Thomas, T-H-O-M-A-S. Last name? Liam, L-I-A-M. Yeah, I'm not pulling anything up under him either. Oh, that's crazy. I remember purchasing it from y'all. You purchased it from drive time. Yes, ma'am, I did. Okay, so what do I do about this car being possessed from a Ouija board? I mean, unfortunately, there's nothing I can do about a possessed car. Do y'all have any, like, holy oil that I can come in and buy from y'all? No. Oh, not at all. Shoot. So do y'all do, like, an exorcism on the car or something? Ah, uh, you might want to call a priest about that. I'm not 100% sure. Okay, do you have the number for the priest? Oh, shoot. Is there anything else I can help you with? Um, no, ma'am. Thank you so much. I appreciate your time. Have a good day. Yes, ma'am. No me problem. too. Bye. Maybe it's the dead messing with y'all, but, like, I don't remember calling. Um, but I do have a quick question for you while I'm on the phone. Um, do you think y'all are able to, um, dig up my husband and get his suit? Because I do need to return it back to where it came from. Today you up in what now? 
Are y'all able to get my husband's suit? Like, can y'all dig up his body and get his suit so I can return it back to where it came from? How long has he been in the ground? Um, he's been in the ground for three or four days. What's his name? Um, I can't put a name on his face right now because I had so much going on, honestly. If I seen his face, then I would know. Maybe I have the wrong place then. We're in, we're in Tennessee. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm down in Florida on vacation right now, but I can be up there. And um, How long are y'all going to be open for? Uh, we close at four. Okay. Um, can I meet up with you next week then? Yes, we close it. We work, work seven to four. Okay, so I can meet up with you next week and we can go out to the grave site and... I can see if I can figure out his name and we can dig up his body. Is that okay? Uh, we, we're not allowed to dig, it, dig him up. Well, I don't have the equipment. Do you know what funeral home you used? I believe it was through y'all. We don't have a funeral home. Oh. Sorry, I've just had so much going on. It's ridiculous. Yes, sir. Um, I can meet up with you by next week, though. That's fine. All right. Um, what, where do you live? Where do you what state? Um, I'm in, I do live in Knoxville, Tennessee. Oh, I got you. I got you. Um, and see, so we're, we're in Middle Tennessee. Okay. I think you might have us confused with another place. I don't think so, but I honestly might because I've had so much going on. I just lost my husband of 36 years, so it's definitely hit hard. I understand, ma'am. I understand, ma'am. Where, where was he from originally? He was from Knoxville. Knoxville. I got you. I got you. Did he have any ties to Shelbyville? Yes, sir. I just need him back, honestly. I understand. I understand. It just breaks my heart. I don't know what you could do about that. Uh, there's not much I can do. I'm sorry. Does your wife do counseling? Uh, no, ma'am. Shoot. Uh, Janie, J-A-N-I-E. J-A-N-I-E. Yes, sir. What's your last name? Morrison, M-O-R-R-I-S-O-N. Gotcha. All right, Miss Morrison. Just let us know. All right, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Yes, All right, bye.